A top government official in Poland has warned the country should not remain a member of the European Union at any cost, as skepticism of Brussels continues to rise following the latest political fallout. In an interview published on Friday, Justice Minister Zbigniew Obro accused the bloc of illegal blackmail over judicial reforms proposed by the Polish government and insisted the nation should question its continued membership if it continues to be treated as residents of colonies who are to submit to the interests of powerful and influential countries. I am a staunch opponent of succumbing to the illegal blackmail of the European Union carried out by the Court of Justice of the European Union, Ziobro told Rzeczpospolita daily. The belief that the EU is a good uncle and gives us money, and that we should accept all its demands at all costs, is propaganda and false. The minister claimed Poland's EU membership is becoming more and more costly and suggested that Poles are beginning to notice that subsequent EU regulations and taxes are becoming an ever greater financial burden for us. Tension has risen between the member state and Brussels after Polish judges struck down demands from the European Court of Justice that new constitutional reforms passed by the democratically elected Polish government be suspended. The governing law and justice party decided to root out and remove communist-era judges who remain on the bench, despite the sweeping changes that have taken place across Poland since the fall of the tyrannical Soviet Union. Poland should not respect unlawful judgments in any area, Ziobro insisted. Agreeing to them in the case of the courts will be an incentive to act in the same way in the sphere of important economic interests, as well as in ideological matters, such as introducing LGBT propaganda to schools. The KGU issues its rulings according to political, not legal, criteria, taking into account, first of all, the interests of the EU's strongest players. If we go back, it will be just another tactical retreat, which, like previous attempts, will result in an even greater escalation of the demands made by the EU against Poland. This is the way to the gradual loss of our subjectivity and sovereignty, he warned.